Okay everyone, so in this video, we're gonna learn how we can mine flux, alright? So to do this, just go to runonflux.io, alright? If you don't uh, know how to spell this, just search for flux coin on Google and go to this one, runonflux.io. Awesome. So, now we're gonna go and select the miner we want to use. So we're gonna go to this one, explore and go down to miner. Go down to this one, mining pools. Here you see some mining pools that you can use when you want to mine a flux coin. So in this tutorial, we're gonna mine with minerpool.org, okay? But you can use any of these if you like. So I'm gonna click on minerpool.org. All right, so now we're gonna go and click on this one, connect. Okay, so then you got this pop-up, connection details. Now you're gonna choose where you are in the world. So if you are in Europe, US or Asia, all right? So in my case, I'm in Europe. And you also need to choose which port you're gonna use. If you have like a single GPU uh, or rigs below 50 SOL, you're gonna use this port. If you have a common GPUs, rig, small farms, you're gonna use this port, all right? So we're gonna go down and now we're gonna choose the miner. So in my case, I'm gonna choose G minor, but you can use mini Z or LOL minor, okay? Uh, G minor is for both uh, AMD and Nvidia. So I'm gonna choose this one, all right? And here we have the information we need to add in the bat file. And also you need to set your password and make sure to not just use X because uh, anyone can guess it uh, and change your custom payouts settings, all right? Okay, so now we're gonna go and click on this one, download. And we're gonna go down to... We're gonna go to GitHub, click on this link. And this will take us to a G minor release page on GitHub. We're gonna go down to this one and click on uh, releases. So the latest one is uh, 2.71. We're gonna go down. So in this tutorial, we're gonna do this for Windows. So I'm gonna click on this one, Windows 64.zip. All right, so I'm gonna open this in uh, folder. I'm gonna right click. I'm gonna extract this uh, zip file. I'm gonna use 7-zip. If you don't have 7-zip, just Google it and install it. Or use any other extractor. So I'm gonna click on this one, extract to G minor. Like that. I'm gonna drag this to the desktop. I'm gonna X this one. We can open up this folder. And now we have uh, this folder, mine underscore cell cache. So this is the one we're gonna use. We're gonna right click, I'm gonna rename this to mine underscore flux. All right, hit enter. We're gonna right click one more time. We're gonna click on edit. So now we have this uh, bad file where we want to add our information. So we're gonna go back to minor pool and we're gonna copy this example, copy. And if you are in US, you're gonna add NA. If you are in Asia, you're gonna add Asia, all right? So in my case, I'm in Europe, so I'm gonna add EU. So as you can see, I have EU right here, but you need to change if you are in US, NA, or Asia, if you are in Asia. All right, so we're gonna copy this. I'm gonna go back to the bat file. We're gonna delete this. And we're gonna paste the new information. All right, so make sure that you have the correct uh, server address. So I'm in Europe, so EU, or US, NA, Asia, Asia. A port uh, for uh, bigger GPUs, bigger rigs and uh, farms, higher than 50 soul, you're gonna use 2033, otherwise you're gonna use this one, 2032, right? Okay, so this is all set. Now we need to add the wallet and working name and your password. 
So let's just change the working name to Mars, like so. Uh, password, you can add it to whatever you like. I'm just gonna add it to 1234 for now, but uh, make sure to add a great password so no one can get in and play with your payout settings. All right, so the last thing we're gonna need is a wallet. So we're gonna go back to Flux page. We're gonna go to uh, this one, download Cellcore. This will open up uh, the Cellcore IO wallet for Flux. And we're gonna go and click on try now. So now you have download Cellcore at your favorite platform. So you have on your phone, Google Play, App Store or App Gallery. On your desktop device, you have Windows, Mac, Linux. So in my case, I'm just gonna go and click on Windows. I'm gonna choose desktop. So let's open this file. I'm gonna go and click on sync account to this device. So now we can create a new account. Just add your username, add your password, confirm password. And after that you have this one, create recovery password uh, mechanism. If you click uh, on the question mark, you can see what this is. So password recovery mechanism will be stored locally on this device. Uh, associated with your account and encrypted. Uh, this can be helpful in case you forget your password. So I'm gonna check this one. After that we're gonna go and click on sync account to this device. So create recovery password mechanism. You're gonna select uh, the question, add answer, hit plus sign to add another one. So I'm gonna add three questions and after that just click on Register account and make sure to read this text so you know what to do. Just click on sync account to this device. Now just log into your account. I'm gonna allow access for cell core. All right, so now we're just gonna go and click on flux. We're gonna go and click on receive and just copy your uh, flux. Uh, wallet address go back to the bat file and we're gonna paste it right here instead of wallet like so that's it we're gonna hit on X click on save and now you should be good to go we're gonna go to the folder we're gonna double click on mine underscore flux Okay, so we are now mining uh, Flux coin uh, with the G miner. We are using the pool minerpool.org and we also have the wallet cell core. Okay, so now we can see that we have two GPUs 1660 Ti and 13080. We have the temperature right here. We can also see the fan speed and we can also see how much uh, soul we are mining at so we have 19.8 for the 1660 ti and 70.2 uh, for the 3080 all right so now it's uh, up to you to just go and try to overclock this to get maximum uh, hash rate and also we can go to minerpool.org and check uh, your stats so just uh, exit this one and now go to the search bar and just paste your wallet address, hit enter. So now we can see the stats uh, in the miner pool. Okay, so I've been mining for a couple of hours just to give you more stats. And here you can see a lot of stats uh, from your mining. So here you see your curve where your hash rate uh, goes up and down uh, during a period of time, all right? We have current hash rate and we have average uh, two hours hash rate. So here you have some stats, you have info, you have balance. And here you can change the threshold for payout. And if you want to change it, you have to add a password that you have in your rig and change the threshold. All right. We can see that I have mined uh, 0 0.27 flux. They also have this uh, loyalty program, 
So if you mine more with uh, minerpool.org, they're gonna pay you some extra flux. And then we have this uh, pending uh, parallel assets. That means uh, when you mine flux, you will also get uh, some of these coins. All right. You can just click on information right here and read more about it. But uh, the big thing is that you don't need to add an extra wallet address. You can just use the same as your Flux address. And when you make a payout from your balance, uh, then you will get uh, these coins as well. But all information you can just click right here and read about it in more detail. All right, everyone. So this is how you can uh, mine uh, Flux on Windows. Also, if you'd like to join our Discord server, I have a specific channel here for Fluxcoin. You can go in here, join us. You find the link in the description and you can talk about Fluxcoin right here if you need any help or just talk about mining in general. We have other topics as well. Okay, everyone, so this is how you can start to mine Fluxcoin. Uh, comment below if this uh, worked out for you. So if you like more of these mining videos, subscribe and you have an awesome day. Take care and bye.